I'm Little Leprechaun and welcome back to The Hangman. Once again, I've forgotten to turn my volume down before I start. Whoa, look how high that is. Whoop. Whoop. There we go. <laughs> um, I can't actually remember where we left off. Um, we just did the bit. I'm sure we saw a thing with a dog. Uh... We solved the thing with the map, didn't we? Yeah. Okay. So. I'm going to see if I can go past the th creepy place now. Feels like somebody's watching. From here? Oh no, I went in! Sealed. Bed. Chair. Oh. Oh no, I'm not doing anything with that chair. Just yet. Okay. Um. Uh. Yes? Oh. Uh. Still feel like someone's watching. Fair enough. It's something to do with his. Uh. Not that one. Uh. Nope. No. It was something to do with the di the was it in a diary or something? I think so. <coughs> and something about him not being like like not being like to be watched. Is it in here? Yeah, yeah. Uh three two O for drawing on the floors. It's something about being watched. He sits in his chair by the bed, up against the bars, looking into the hall through the tape. Oh, so do we have to push it? Right, okay. Oh, pardon me. Then can we go? So we have to push it up to the bars, I'm guessing, then. Oh, oh, that's cool. We have to use a. Uh oh, hold on. We need to rotate it. So he needs to be looking. Uh, there we go. Almost there. Because he has to look through the tape. Oh, it looks. Oh, I thought there was a person just kind of. Is that it? A chair? We can do the tape, yeah. So now what? Uh, can I go closer to the... Oh! Oh, I don't know whether I want to do that. Oh. Oh, do I want to do that? Oh. Everyone watching you. I, oh, no. oh no. I'm Oh no, I'm actually uh, Oh. Oh, okay. Okay. Oh, I, I was expecting something to jump at me then. Oh gosh. We can leave now, well, we can leave. It's fine. Is that it? Can we go? Someone. Oh. 
everyone watching you. Can we do that? Should I do that? That's the question. Yeah, 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 I know. Um. Oh, I'm trying to think. Which one has been worst? Like, out of the four I've played. I think this one, so far. Uh, a bad feeling went away. Cool, great, fantastic, nice. What's in here? And it's a shower. Okay. Uh. Oh, another one of these. Cool. Are we going to see uh, Misery again? Oh. Hello? Wow, I can see the whole forest. These woods are really big. This hospital must have been built to be hidden. After all, it was full of weirdos. Of course they'd want to hide it. That shouldn't have happened. My drama piece is actually on stuff like this, which is fun. All the patients here had their own worlds. They didn't try to leave them, so all you could do was remove them from society. Yeah, that's one way of looking at it, yeah. <clears throat> and I guess I'm the same way. I'm locked up in my own world. Everyone else thinks I'm nuts. What's going to happen to me, I wonder? It'll be okay. What? Oh, Keith! What are you doing out here? You found your rat yet? No. Don't smoke. You said earlier about how Pop could talk. Do you actually think that? I should have never told you that. I already knew you wouldn't believe me. That's how it's been for a long time. I see animals talking and things others don't see. But no one's ever believed me. Hmm. The truth is all animals can talk. But no one believes them, so they don't. Who told you that? Old Billy. An old skinny dog at my counselor's place. Eek! Won't talk as nobody will believe it, huh? Sounds like somebody I know. Me? So, what started it? Oh, this is going to be interesting. Huh? Animals talking, seeing weird stuff. Was there something that started it all off? Keith, the therapist! Because you're qualified. Started it? <sighs> it was the hanged man. Oh, no! Oh, wait, no. And that makes me think of the crooked man <laughs> with the knees at the end. And, uh. Oh, God. Yeah. <laughs> the hanged man. So that's where the name of the game comes in. Fuck enough. The more I say, the more you'll think I'm nuts. Well, maybe not. Well, I suppose you might fall under that category. Keith! When I was a kid, I judged a lot by what's visible. This person looks good. This person's athletic. This person's smart. The seeds of imagination get trimmed as soon as they bud. Because in a small community, they just get in the way. Not many people can grow and write. If you can get a good flower to bloom, that could be a big advantage to you. Nothing to moan and groan over. Hmm. Just stop it. Don't talk like you understand. You're just saying you don't believe me either, right? Uh, was that what he was saying? I don't really see. Sure, I'm not going to believe you. <clears throat> I do happen to think it's very interesting. Something wrong with that? I suppose not. Are we gonna... I sort of get what you're saying, but... But... Because of my weirdness, people suspect mom of treating me badly. I don't want to trouble her anymore. Oh. What do you think parents are for? Did they she? Act like stepping stones for their kids. If you can make her smile someday, it's fine. What was it? You give up your rat search for today. It's only going to get darker. Besides, David's worried about you. <laughs> back, David's gonna. Go, what are you? No, he's not. Like he could be worried about me. He might be. David's a really cool guy. What's that supposed to mean? Don't insult Keith. Not Keith. David. Not his cousin. Huh? I'm David's. Oh! Father. It's just our father who's. The oh! Father. Oh! I did think they looked a lot alike, but 
Oh! Oh, oh yeah, because David's father left his mother. So he must have gone with someone else. Uh, Wells. Oh! For a long time, I never knew. But my mom was on the phone the other day. Generic teenage bedroom. Is food ready yet? I'm hungry. Don't get no. <clears throat> Mr. Hoover, please just leave it be. It's all on me. What? Mom? Mom, rather, whatever. That's no, I didn't know, but I found out about you later. I couldn't do anything, and I feel terrible about what happened to your mother. Will has nothing to do with this, all right? Please, don't say anything to him. So did they grow up thinking they were cousins? And then... He loved his father. I don't want to disillusion him. Um... Mom? Will! S sorry about that. It's time to eat, isn't it? I'll start getting it ready. I've never seen my mom cry before. Hoover. The person I met at Dad's funeral all those years ago. Hmm. So they didn't know each other at all? His mother's room. You shouldn't go snooping through your mum's stuff, kid. But okay. Hmm. Put it back. A diary. It's Dad's. Huh. I found out by reading Dad's diary. After Mom got pregnant with me, he divorced David's mom. Oh, okay. Right, right. So David's dad was married to David. Obviously, David's dad was married to his mother and had David. Then did he... Ch it seems like he cheated, had an affair, whatever, had Will, and... Right, okay. Mom never knew Dad had another family until he died. He kept it a secret the whole time. Oh wow, that's impressive. There were a lot like of impressive in a bad way. Photos of David and his mom. Hmm. He wrote about a lot of old memories and things too. He also wrote, "I regret abandoning my family." Ooh. Fuck. Whenever I meet him, David won't even look at me. I doubt I'll ever be forgiven for abandoning my frail wife and my middle school age son. Well, no. <laughs> You did cheat and have an entire the diary also had a letter in it. The letter came with the hangman card and said you're a demon child. Is that talking about Will or David? See that's that letter you have? Hmm. I'm sure this letter didn't come from Dad. It must have been addressed to me and he hid it. Hmm. After all, I stole Dad away from David. Uh, no, don't blame yourself. His his dad shouldn't have Cheated. It's all because of me. No. He ruined David's family. No. He ruined his own family. Not David. I think it was David who wrote that letter, and David was the one who called and made your mom cry. Huh. So that's why. It's no, not necessarily. It's just I can't think of any other possibility. Right. Mom is always cheerful and tough, but she was crying. Mom's being threatened by somebody. I'm not able to protect her. Oh, Will. Pop tried to stop me. He said, what good will do go? What can you even do? I... But I just couldn't stand it. Mom had David's address written down, so I used that to... Uh-huh. Well, you didn't have to lie and say you were his cousin. <sighs> David was the one who said that. After I broke some merchandise at a fishing shop and he got called in. Right. Eh? 
What'd you do that for? Get his attention? Dad liked to fish. He used to take me along. I was lost and wandered into a fishing shop. I saw the same fishing rod Dad used to have. Right, okay, so that explains that. I thought of how Mom was suffering because of Dad. Before I knew it, I was stomping it to pieces. Huh. I came to apologize to David. To say I'm sorry for messing up his family. So that explains so when did that and caused him more trouble. So I ended up just running away. Right. Why am I such a coward? I don't know what I should do anymore. Things are starting to make more sense. Well, not stomp all over your determination, but I don't think the letter you've got was written by David. That isn't David's writing. Oh, okay, never mind. And at least in my opinion, he doesn't have the guts to threaten others. <laughs> He's stupidly good-natured. I mean, you're not wrong. On top of that, you say David called your mom, but you didn't hear the conversation, right? Isn't it jumping the gun to say he's threatening her? Thank you, Keith. Then this letter was written by someone else. Whatever it was that led you here, you came to talk to David, right? Yes. And David could have pretended you were a stranger, but he didn't. He decided to take you with him. He must have wanted to talk to you. And I ran away. <clears throat> In which case, you ought to meet him properly. If you think you've troubled him, apologize for it. You're only a real coward if you give up now. I like Keith! There's one other person I need to apologize to. Oh, who's that? Who's that? Oh. <laughs> the owner of the fishing shop. Oh, right. I was too scared and nervous, so I never apologized for breaking the merchandise. See, he's a good kid! I do that. Why don't we go do it now? Yeah. Forget about Pop. Let's go do that now. I'll be heading out after a little more searching. You should consider this scene. If you really want to keep going, there's always tomorrow. See you. Bye. Wait, take me with you. Keith. Yes. Um, Keith. Was your son important to you? Yes! It was his son! <laughs> yeah. Best guy in the world. I still think so now. Aww. <laughs> I wouldn't call your old man's decision right or wrong. Either way, it hurt people. And he regretted it himself. Yeah, but... <laughs> Putting yourself through pain might seem irrational to you. But that's the way a lot of things are. If you butted everyone, it would be hard to live. <sighs> what I can say is, don't grovel. Your old man didn't make his decision for you to do that. It was just his way of settling things. Not a good way. Stick out your chest and don't lose sight of your goal. You didn't come all this way to cry and say, it's my fault, did you? I mean, there may be crying involved, but... Bye, Keith. Good talk. He's right. Whatever got me to come here, I've made it this far, so I'd better do what I need to do. I still haven't talked with David yet, and I still need to find Pop. There's no time to be crying. So, that was that. Uh, oh, it stopped. Uh, this way? Ooh! Date storage. Uh, the uh, day room. Thank you. Okay. Oh. Oh. Oh, stop. Oh, what is that? No. Oh. It looks like a person creepy. Yeah, we're leaving! We're leaving! We're leaving right now, Will. Trash shoot. 
trash, put the trash in the chute. I swear to God, I just heard something. There's... Oh... Right, okay, so we can't. Okay, that's fine. Artwork coming for... Oh, so someone made it. Can I see it? I love shake hands with good people. I mean, yeah. Uh... Oh, there we go. Oh, no, this is that. Oh, no. I'm just gonna walk by. It can go. Oh, my God. <sighs> oh, no. No, no, I'm leaving. What the hell? No. I want to shake hands. That's obviously got to do with that, right? Is that one? Is there a hole where I can put my... Right, no. Oh, that was horrific. That was... <sighs> oh my god. Is there something else I need to read first? Steph must always wear a name tag. Oh, do I need to put a name tag on? Oh! Hold on, can I read that again? Uh, just in three. Kenny hated me especially. There we go, right. Okay, now let me... You won't want to shake hands with me, will you? No. Right, okay. Okay, that's fine. We're gonna go. We're gonna go. You don't want to talk to me. That's fine. I don't want to talk to you either. <laughs> <sighs> Screw you, Kenny! What the hell is that? What is that noise? Why is that open? <laughs> Stop doing loud noises! Oh my god! We have to go in? Oh... Oh, that looks like blood. It doesn't look like a person. What's written on the floor? <laughs> Demons are coming from the shower room, from the hallway, and now even from this room. This place is hell. The screams of the dead echo here. The demons must be stopped at once. We're leaving! <sighs> right. From the bathroom, um, from the hall. Oh, have we got to get rid of the things? How do I do that? It looks so sort of like. Oh, I don't. Uh, do I have. Uh, spray can. Spray over it. Oh, there we go. Yeah. 
Right, here we go from the hallway. Uh, we'll do this and then we can end it. Go away! Uh, from the shower. Fuck you, Kenny. No one likes Kenny. I don't like Kenny. Ooh. From the shower. Uh, where is the shower? Is it this one? Or is it upstairs? Yeah, here we go. Yeah, we know it looks like a person. Well, thank you for stating the obvious once again. There we go. Right. Have we done it now? Is that it? Either way, we're going to leave it there. So, uh, <laughs> thank you very much for watching. I, sorry if I um, hurt anyone's ears screaming. I might need to put a uh, warning for that up in editing. So, yeah, I will see you tomorrow for the next episode of Het Oni, which may be the last. I'm not quite sure whereabouts we are with it. So, yeah. Bye-bye. <coughs>